Hello YouTube, it's Doss Gregor, and welcome to something a little new I'm going to try. This is what I'm going to call Gen 2 Tidbits. And as I'm messing around in my box and doing things, updating packages, learning little things here and there, when I run across a little gem that I think you guys might like, or might be handy to know because it's like, ooh, I'm glad to know that. Besides that, I sometimes have to watch my videos too just to relearn some things that I've taught myself or forgotten over time. So the other day I was talking with Linux for you and me and he was working with layman overladies and I was look he asked me what overlays I was using. I had four listed. And I was trying to think, do I even use anything out of those overlays? Is there a way to tell what you have installed from an overlay because I'm thinking if I don't have anything out of these overlays I can get rid of them because overlays can be dangerous because if they've got packages that might get pulled in when you do an update world it's possible that an extra overlay package could have something that your system isn't really ready for that then suddenly causes all kinds of other things to be pulled in and mess things up. So after doing some research I found a great command line that works well. And that command line is you have to do all like a you have to do a check underscore installed underscore overlay equals true and that tells EIX to look at all installed overlays and then EIX dash capital J. When you run this command it's going to give you a list. Now if you don't use overlays that much it won't be that long. In my case here, let's see, right here is where it starts. And you'll see that I've got Steam Client Meta, Steam Games Meta because of the Steam, um, Steam Launcher, Steam Meta, and then simple screen recorder and down here it tells me that I've got two overlays that I'm using and one is Anders Larsen for the simple screen recorder and of course Steam for the Steam programs. That comes in very handy because when I did that I was able to tell that I had Java overlay and a wire overlay which I was like what are those being used for? Well evidently they're not being used for anything so I was actually able to remove them and get rid of them. That is a very handy command to have. Something to remember that if you're going to use layman or overlays to check out that little command if you ever want to see just what you've installed from an overlay. And that once again check underscore installed underscore overlays equals true space EIX dash J. Now EIX is another portage program that you can install and it is a lot like Emerge except it has some pretty neat more advanced features that I need to look at because honestly I've been using Gen 2 for so long that I'm just comfortable with Emerge and never looked at EIX before but it looks like I need to do that because this definitely helps out a lot. So if it's morning, evening, noon or night, whatever you're having, I hope you'll have it, enjoy it, etc, etc. Yeah. Bye, guys.